Paul, can you sidewall stall? We'll find out. That didn't work out. We'll try one more time. And the answer is yes. Yes, you can. Every morning, I have my bowl of eggs. I'm gonna make 35 of them, and I have some organic baby arugula, pure vegetable oil. Better than your olive oil, which is also better than your butter. So I'll make sure I get myself a good splash of that here, splash of that there. Make sure you have a wide assortment of hot sauces here. Hot sauce one, hot sauce two, hot sauce three, and hot sauce four. And as many bananas as you can force down in the morning. Seriously, I like to have about one or two bananas uh, a day. So definitely one with breakfast and usually one with dinner, sometimes one with lunch. We're gonna mix this thing around, stir it around, make sure all that vegetable oil is ready to go. Let's talk about eggs, but first, I never cook breakfast without it. In fact, I don't go many places without it, my lacrosse stick. The reason why I have my lacrosse stick while I cook is to make sure I'm getting solid reps. All right, so here we go. Let's fire up this arugula. I like to throw a bunch of that. You'll be surprised how, when it simmers, how much it sautés and shrinks and you can eat a ton of arugula. Usually, sometimes this whole box, I'm gonna save some for later though. Here we go, fire up the eggs here. So, got the trash can open and we're gonna start counting. One, two, three, four, Five, now we're switching over. We're going egg whites only. Boom, boom. Sometimes you miss. But the goal is five eggs and three more eggs, just the egg whites. Now let's get a chopping and mixing. Nice and mixed up. Find out what's going on over here. That's looking pretty good. A little pepper. And we start to play the waiting game. Might as well crack open a banana to do that. Again, I like to tend to the eggs all the time. It gives it a better consistency. I don't want the eggs to sit and get super hard. The closing stage here, so I like to drop some really hot, hot sauce on there. I save the mild stuff for on plate. A little tip from my mother, Jean Ann. Take a little bit of water, pour it in there, just to give the eggs a better finishing touch. The water will evaporate as you mix around. We'll transition this over here. Pull this off, those look done. Perfect timing. We're gonna grab ourselves a nice plate and unload. Don't mind that vegetable oil. Ay caramba, bon appetit. All right, everyone, thanks for joining me at my lacrosse meets breakfast. We have eight eggs, three of them egg white only, spinach and arugula. Make sure as you cook, you're working on your soft hands, and if you can, do a sidewall stall. Until next time in Rabel's Kitchen, make sure you subscribe to my channel by clicking right above my left shoulder, and I'll see you next week. Rabel Cuts. Welcome to Hashtag Ask Paul, and today I'm taking you through a typical trip to my barber to get a Rabel Cut. Now, what is a Rabel Cut? It's simple.